I've learned never to burn bridges. Um, I was about 25, 26 years old, so it's been some time ago. And I fell out with a very dear friend of mine. And we were, you know, rising politicians at the time. I'd gotten into politics and we, 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 we ran this, you know, the whole game. We had all of the folks that we needed on our side to win in this game. And that was tough back then, especially being women, especially being black women. But uh, we came to an impasse and we just couldn't agree to disagree. And it cost us our friendship. Not only did it cost me a very dear friend, it cost me friends because people took sides. They took sides. Um, a lot of people took her side. A lot of people took my side. And people even tried to uh, bring us back together and have us sit down and talk and work it out. And we just couldn't. We were so passionate. I was so passionate in what I felt was right. And she was so passionate in what she felt was right. And when you're young, you know, you feel like you are invincible and that everything that you're doing is the right thing and everybody else is wrong. And looking back, I just realized that I should have stepped away for a minute, agreed to disagree and come back, come back to my friend. Friendships, true loving friendships are so hard to come by. And I've learned that that was a bridge I should never have burned. To this day, we are still not friends. Uh, we've gotten married, we've raised families. We could have been in each other's lives. Um, she had two daughters, I had two daughters. But because I was dead set on being right and insisting that she was wrong, I was willing to burn that bridge to walk away from that friendship. And now I realize that it was a bridge that should not have been burned. I realize that if that person is a good person and it's not anything having to do with moral character or something that's bringing um, some, something into your life that's destroying you or your family, which none of it was, then you have to realize the value of friends. We could have been power brokers by, by now. We could have run the whole state of Maryland, to be quite frank. That's, that's how bad to the bone we were. And, um, you know, hindsight is twenty twenty. But I would always say, never burn bridges. Oh.